So from first moment, you know, you can get a lot of benefit out of this Paul technologies because you can see the real time, the heart rate responses, and also training load after a training session. So after the first training session, you can really see a lot of information. I, I could see the results from the day one. So one of the features of the um, Polar system is a train and load. Um, so we use that aspect as, as one of a number of aspects of monitoring the players. So it gives you an overall summary of the load of each player based on the time in each of their different heart rate training zones. Um, so we use that, you know, as well as some of the other data. Um, and it just gives you an overall picture of how hard the session has been for the player. You get a sense of where you are physically, but there's nothing, nothing better than the reinforcement from the Polar equipment and technology. To, to let us know exactly where we are. You know, we all have a good feeling, but until we know exactly where we are physically during and after training, um, there's no substitute for that. It just gives you a good indicator of whether or not, how hard you're working, um, if you're recovered after your workouts the next day, um, if you're still fatigued and you maybe need to take it a little bit lighter that day. So it's just a really good indicator telling you how, how much you're doing on and off the field, actually. It gives us the opportunity to have constant feedback with our fitness coaches and, and coaches in order to maintain uh, the current level of training reduce or increase uh, accordingly to how the players perform on that particular day. We look at above 90% of the heart rate max, so if we can make sure they get X amount of minutes in that zone, then we know we're improving them aerobically. And the other side is looking at recovery rates, so again, if they're doing a practice or a drill, how quickly does their heart rate drop down to normal, so again, another indicator of fitness level. Um, and then also with the, the Polar Watch, there's a nice little way of monitoring how, what kind of recovered state the players are in. And with that, we can see are the players overtrained, fatigued, and just build that into the whole profile of the player. So we've learned quickly, and now it's, we're able to use them on our own at, at home, and it's, it's easy. We just turn in our minutes and go from there, and she collects the data and sees how, how we're doing each week. In the off-season, our, our workouts are programmed on the Polar Watch by our club fitness coach and uh, we are required to, to run accordingly and uh, it's been a wonderful help during the off season. You know, soccer training basically we cannot control the distance of a sprint or the duration of the work or you know, how many times they make a change of direction, those kind of stuff. So it's really you know, important to see their actual physical response from the soccer training. The more information we gather and the more training you do with the technology, it, it, it gives you um, a bigger database in order to have your target of where you want to be physically. Now that's not the only aspect of becoming a professional athlete, but it is certainly, it is certainly a very important one and the most important one to maintain your fitness. I mean, everyone's going hard, everyone's going to train hard, you need to make sure that they're recovering properly. And I think that's been a big key, especially because we have a wide range of ages on this, um, on this team, ranging from like 36, 37 to uh, 22 year olds, you know? So everybody's going to be different, everybody's different. So I think it's important, and I, I absolutely recommend um, Polar to any team. I mean, from any sport, really. I mean, you really got to uh, monitor your players and the fatigue and the amount of workload they're doing as well. Obviously it means you can optimise what you're doing in your training um, if you're monitoring your heart rate so you can make sure you're getting a physical outcome as well as technical outcome. So even if you know grassroots right through to elite level I think any team would get benefit from from either using a team system with a whole team or individuals using the heart rate monitors. I just think it's massive in terms of the outcomes players can get from their training. I would definitely recommend using this power technology to the other coaches and fitness coaches uh, because this will give you a lot of information uh, on the players and this is very useful to the planning and executing also reviewing the training sessions. I can only pass it on and say use it because all of my experiences have been very positive and uh, have only but helped myself and my teammates.